cricket match. Let's get to our guest straight away. Uh, I've got uh, Ajay Rathra with me, Tushar Gupta is with us, and we also have a cyber expert uh, with us at this point. And I'm going to ask him the question first up as we bring in Jitain Jain. Jitain, if we know this happened, if we know this happened, Jitain, why can't we block it or why can't we counter it? Or how do we go after this lot now? How do we go after them? You see, it's been happening from last four years. This is the, you know, uh, part of Pakistan's devious, uh, you know, cyber operation strategy to divide and lead India with thousands of pounds in cyber ecosystem every month. Now, you look at this whole campaign for last year mm. of Indian Muslims in danger, posting fake videos and photos and instigating people during Delhi riots, you know, uh, running several thousands uh, mm. of accounts during farmer protests, fake accounts. Or you take example of, you know, uh, mass skill mm. trolling of Mohammed Shami impersonating and mass-contouring as Indian accounts. This has been happening for, you know, almost four or five years now. Even in Sri Lanka, very recently, this whole ISPR bot factory was running a campaign that it was Indian mm. government which was behind making Rajapaksa escape. This is a larger mm. ISPR mm. operational right. plan lead India with 1,000 bonds. But now, the problem here is that our agencies have literally failed to detect these campaigns on time. They have once, even if they sometimes detect, they have completely failed to expose them in time. Or is, and the result is, I mean, mm. uh, Hindi mein kahawat hai ki Pakistan ka jhoot big gaya pure bajar mein dofair tak hum shaam tak apna ek sach pakad kar baithe rahe. So if you do not expose this campaign Baitere. within 24 hours, damage is already done. There is not much you can do about it now. So this whole, you know, IP address of Pakistan, your mm. Wikipedia page was being edited by Pakistan or tomorrow if you release the report that how these thousands of accounts from Pakistan was operating and running a fake campaign uh, uh, impersonating as Indian accounts. The damage is already mm. done. Our mainstream media have been debating about our society. Our politicians are blaming each other that is Indian society or a set of political groups which are running this campaign. And in reality, it is ISPR. They have already succeeded in their campaign because the very, very occasion that we are having is uh, this debate mm. on this trolling, brutal trolling, or you know, this Khalistani campaign uh, linking to um, our prestigious cricketers is the very victory of Pakistan. And this is what we have to stop. So there are three things we can do. A, government has to figure out a way that mm. they detect these campaigns and expose them in time. Not only detect, expose them in uh, time to the larger public. Two, we as a society have to figure out that. Mm. These hate mongers sitting in Pakistan trying to project and destroy, you know, uh, project themselves as Indians and destroys India's credentials as a secular and plural society are running a coordinated disinformation campaign. So, do not retweet any hateful content from anyone you do not know. Do not reply or follow any account whom you do not know on Twitter because it is impossible to say that let's have uh, you know mm. KYC accounts and all that doesn't work on social media. Uh, three, what government has to figure out is that how do you go after them? So, you know, make a list of accounts, get them, start getting them blocked, and yeah. there has to be a political consensus, which is completely lacking. Look, in the case of farmer mm. protests, government wanted to block 1,200 Pakistan's ISPR handles, which were fake handles, mass as yeah. Indian identities. Now, we had a huge political debate that government is indulging into censorship, they are, you know, killing free speech and all that stuff. Now, the same very Congress and other political mm. parties are saying that why government is not acting in time, what they have done since yesterday. So, A, we as a society have to develop a consensus. Mm that if we have to keep our cyberspace safe, if we have to keep our societies safe from ISI and ISPR, we will have to have a national consensus that we have to block all these accounts. We have to censor any information which is originated from Pakistan. No, targeting not, our society, not just, not just defensive. Not, but, but, true, but Jitain, not just defensive. We have to go out all out on the offensive also. We also need to have a one counter can, One can always say that we should give Pakistan a test of their own medicine. The, the, no, I always say that we should give Pakistan a test of their no, own no. medicine. I think beyond that, I think we are very well able to understand what you mean. Correct, I understand. Not just a taste of, and we don't need to talk about it. But it'll, 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 it'll see, it's a, uh, it'll see, it'll see. Yeah, and in the in the cyberspace, it needs to be done without having to say anything else. Plus, the other part is yeah. that may the tribe grow that is exposing this vitriol, which uh, which is immediately doing a deep dive and putting out the facts. And the reason why we are talking about it is so that we are also conscious and we are able to make people the uh, people conscious through uh, through the show that you cannot su subscribe to this kind of vitriol and you have to reject it. Even if you see a blue tick and if you see some people who are doing this, you need to reject it, block them or turn around and say, Correct. 
I'm saying whoever it is, Jitain, what I'm trying to say is whoever it is, we as conscious Indians need to know that we should yeah. not fan the flames and we should reject it outright. The other thing is, and then immediately run, you can mount a counter campaign and trend it far greater, which, which says we love you, Ashdeep, we are proud of you, India. Simple. And then it, then, then it ends there. And, uh, and, and if the total base of Twitter viewers across India start doing that, then the, all this entire uh, smear campaign is going to get buried anyways. But let me go back.